Hello everyone. So for today's course, we're working on clocks and our module is calendar time. So in today's class, we'll be learning about the amount of days that are in each month and also learning about what a leap year is and how many days the leap year has. So we're first going to start with the amount of days in each month. So we're going to start with the month of January that has 31 days. We have the month of February that has 28 or 29 days. So if it is a regular year, there's 28 days. And if it is a leap year, there is 29 days. So the month of February is the one that has a change, depending if it's a regular year or a leap year. So we have the month of March that has 31 days, the month of April that has 30 days, the month of May that has 31 days, and the month of June that has 30 days. On our next row, you can see we have the month of July with 31 days, the month of August with 31 days, the month of September with 30, and the month of October with 31 days, the month of November with 30 days, and the month of December with 31 days. So go ahead and jot these down because you will need it in our following activity on the next module. You'll need to know how many days are in each month. We have more calendar time here. So one year has 12 months. One year also has 365 days. One leap year has 366 days. And remember the month of February is where that extra day is found. And then one year is about 52 weeks. So our leap year, like I said, is found in the month of February. So if not, February either has 28 or 29 days, depending if it is a leap year. So how many days are in a week? There are seven days in a week, and we learned this also when we were in our lessons of seven multiples. So we learned that there are seven days in one week, so we can multiply seven by the amount of weeks to find out how many days there is. It says how many days is in a leap year, so we've learned there is 366 days in a leap year, and that extra day is found in the month of February, because then the month of February would have 29 days. And how many days is there in a year? So in a regular year, there is 365 days. And that means the month of February would only have 28 days. So go ahead and take notes on this important information because in our next module, you're going to need these numbers.